What's up everyone, Takedown here. Welcome back to another Flipping for Profit video. Today we're going to be checking out a lot of 240 video games that I did purchase. I got a great price. I paid a dollar each, $240 for 240 video games. Everything from Xbox, Xbox 360, PS2, and PS3. So let's check this out. So sorry for the lighting for the uh, tote here, but we did get a full tote of video games. So just quickly go through them here. Uh, we did get some Xbox 360 games, so they're right here and a row right here. We do have some PS2 games that go here. Underneath the PS2 there is a row of sports games, I'm not expecting much for those. And then underneath the Xbox 360 it's the original Xbox games. We also have over here, I set them over here for now, uh, the PS3 games. We haven't gone through them yet, but here's a glimpse of what's in there. We do have some more games over here. I think this is all sports games. Another stack of PS3. Um, some other games that I just have not gone through yet. So yeah, I think I got a really great deal on everything here. $240. Now my prices usually are for these ones. Typically it's $5 each is what I sell them for. Or $5 for uh, $20. And that equals out to be $4 each. So I only paid a dollar. So if I get $4 each, that is great profit. So I'm expecting around $600 profit just on that alone. But I do also have these ones over here, which I did take out and separate. I did look up uh, some of the prices on these and they sell for anywhere from 10 to $20. I think one of them might be a $40 game somewhere here. So these ones will have to be cleaned up, listed on my eBay or Facebook marketplace and priced individually but I do have to clean them up first but games like Twisted Metal Black for the PS2, Ghost Rider, a whole bunch of different games in here. Um, I do have them just separated from the rest for now so I don't have them mixed up. But these games here are going to be selling for a little bit more so for just the other games um, aside from the sports games, because I don't expect much for those, I'm expecting around $600 profit. For here, uh, these are going to be my extra, so hopefully a lot more. I'm hoping around an extra one or $200 profit from these, so in total, maybe $800 profit. Now, I did sell some games already. These ones here, I did have somebody message, and he wanted the original Xbox games, all the Splinter Cell games, so one of each that I had. He also wanted Halo 2, uh, the Steelbook, which he probably could have been able to tell from the photo that it's all rusty out and the fact that I'm listing it and selling it for $4. But uh, yeah, it's in terrible condition. So I did just send him a photo of that to see if he still wants it because he did say he's a collector. But uh, hopefully he does because that right there is $20. I already sold five games for uh, $20 as well. Those games... One of them was for Xbox, it was uh, Cold Fear, which I had a bunch of people messaging, so I looked it up, and that's a $20 to $30 game. I sold it for $4. I can't remember the condition. I'm assuming it was in rough condition. That's why I sold it so cheap, uh, just to get a couple sales in. But the guy did message back. He wanted a list of everything else that I had, so he's buying this stack right here. So he got Dead Space 2 uh, Limited Edition for PS3, for the PS2, Jack 2, and 3. Fallout 3 Game of the Year Edition, Fallout New Vegas Ultimate Edition, Red Dead Redemption Game of the Year that includes Undead Nightmare, Skyrim Legendary Edition, SmackDown vs. Raw 2007, Oblivion, and Call of Duty Black Ops 2. So he bought all of these. I gave him a deal since he bought from me already. So uh, he offered me $40 for the 11 games. I decided to take that. That's basically $4 each and you get one free. So why not? So, so far I sold $80 and I sold only 20 games. So I have a ton left, but I should definitely be making my profits for these. So comment down below what you guys think. Do you guys think I got a really great deal on these? Personally, I do just on these alone. Hopefully, I'll be coming close to making my money back. And then I have about 200 other games here. So definitely excited to see what I can do with all these and how much money will be made. 
So like I said, most of these games are gonna be sold on Kijiji and Facebook Marketplace, at least the ones that I'm selling for four to five dollars. All the ones that are ten dollars, ten to twenty dollars that I did share that I do have separates, those are gonna be cleaned up and I'm definitely listing them on eBay, but also listing them on Facebook Marketplace and whichever sells first, I'll just take them off the other platform but hopefully we are going to be generating a lot of sales. So far, I've only listed the Xbox games, and what uh, ended up happening is people messaged for some of those. I mentioned that I do have Xbox 360, PS2, and PS3 as well, and that's where some of the sales did happen from. So I don't have the PS2 games listed, the PS3 games listed, or the Xbox 360 games listed yet. That's what I'm gonna be working on today. Hopefully I can list all of that. And my other project for today is to clean up all the other games and test them, the ones that are gonna be sold individually on eBay, take photos of everything, and list everything today. That is my goal, hopefully I can get it done but definitely profit to be made. The one thing I do want to mention is I do list on Kijiji as well, but lately I've had a problem with Kijiji where I can't make new posts. It actually happened about a week or two ago originally, and I ended up contacting them, and they said it's a glitch in the system, and they fixed a couple of my ads. I went to post today the Xbox games, and it won't let me post them, so I do have to contact them again. Hopefully they can get it fixed. Kijiji doesn't generate a lot of sales for me, but it does have an extra couple sales a week uh, that I do get from it. So why not add it to uh, be able to get more sales and hopefully they can get it fixed for me. But most of my sales do come from Facebook Marketplace lately and then eBay. Hopefully I can get that a lot more inventory on it. But hope you guys enjoyed this video. Hopefully I will be doing more uh, flipping for profit videos in the future. Comment down below if you guys want to see more and I'll see you guys in the next video. Please take care. Peace.